Hi uh, everybody, it's Faith from Fire Saints here. I hope everyone's well. Taurus, it's time for you May reading. I apologize for the delay. Um, over the last couple of weeks, it has been nothing but plague after plague of pestilence and mayhem going through my house. Um, last week, it was the stomach flu and a lice outbreak. No lie, my son brought home had lice from school. Duh! All I have to say to that is, bleh. <laughs> so that was like five straight days of doing nothing but washing laundry and vacuuming every piece of furniture and every rug in this house and spraying things down uh, on top of everything else that I have to do <laughs> with my life and existence outside of tarot. And then this week it was, you know, paying bills, again, being an adult, doing the things I needed to do. Yesterday morning when I woke up, I had every intention of sitting down and throwing down cards for people and getting this going. Nope. Son had po food poisoning. So, again, I'm taking care of a sick child. <laughs> Not fun. It is what it is, though. He's back at school. Life's good. It was just a quick life lesson learned for the little dude, so. Okay. Enough about me, Taurus. Let's talk about you. This reading me for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for May 2021. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given to you by the cards if you choose to do anything at all. It's your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. Strength reverse came out. You could possibly be holding back on something. We'll see if it comes back out later. If it doesn't resonate with you, that's okay too. You can check your moon rising, your Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid and all things can and maybe vice versa. It might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. And our dear friends, the cross watchers are always welcome here at the Fireside and Tarot table. Everyone's always welcome here and I appreciate you guys stopping by. If you want to hit the like button, the subscribe button, and the notification bell, cool. I'd appreciate it, but I'm not going to twist your arm. It's your life. Do what you want. If you want to actually view the reading first, too, that's cool. That's totally awesome. I really appreciate that, too. But either way, it's okay. Before I invoke the cards and get them down on the table, there's two things we have to go over. One. Never make any life-altering decision based on a tarot reading. It's just a, not a good idea. I've been reading tarot for many years and studying tarot for a very long time. Just don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Two. If it's not your reading, not your story, not your message, it, leave the cards on the table and walk away. It's a general reading. It's not going to resonate with every Taurus. It's just, that's not how this works. All right. Enough said about that. Heavenly Father, Mother, Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit, Guides, and Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for the month of May 2021. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with us today. Let's bring Taurus to their highest possible good and put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Taurus, why are you here? The moon. Oh, boy. Mm, it's card Pisces. If that's setting off an alarm in your brain, great. If it's not, don't worry about it. You could be dealing with the Pisces. They might have Pisces in their chart. You might have Pisces in your chart. I don't know. It's a card of things going on in the shadows. The unknown. It's it's the fun house card. Changes of perspective. Things don't look the same in the moonlight as they do in the sunshine. Things are obscured. What happened? Justice. Hmm, oh, Lady Justice. She pops up when there's been an injustice. She comes in to level things off. Okay. Could have been a legal matter. Again, if that's setting off an alarm, cool. If it's not, okay. Card of Libra. Throw clarifiers on it in a minute. 
Three may wow. Three major arcana and three cards. Whew. What's going on, Taurus? That's the lovers. Card of Gemini. Mm. Could have been a choice between lovers. It's an opposites attract thing. Definitely some soulmate stuff going on. All right, well. Here and now, Seven of Cups. Speaking of choices. Seven of Cups is a card of options, Taurus. Oh, some of these cups you got to be wary of, though. There's not good things in all of these cups. Okay. What's coming in the future? High Priestess and the Four of Cups. More options, more contemplation. I see an offer coming in, but I don't know if you're going to take it. Another major, the High Priestess. Dark and the light, intuition, more soulmate stuff. But that's a card of using your intuition. Going with your gut. All right. Okay. Take off the bottom. Ten of Pentacles. Throw that up there. You're working toward abundance. Maybe you're financially set. Oof. I do not know how I feel about that. Some shady. Very shady. What's up, Justice? Ace of Swords. Okay. Communication came into Love Off Playing Field. Maybe a piece of information for some of you. You know, it's not always necessarily a love reading. It often turns into that, but not always. What's up the lovers? Another ace, ace of pentacles. Somebody come in with an offer? Is that why someone has to choose? It's small, it's slow moving. Taurus, what is going on? 
Hermit reversed. Oof. Oof. You know, aces represent something new. This is not feeling new. We'll get, we'll get another deck on it in a second. And I'm sorry if this is moving so slowly, but I really need to think this through because this is a puzzle. And you're currently in a state of waiting, weighing options. Hermit reverse, there's a healing process that hasn't totally taken place. Or something poured salt in a wound. I mean, take it however you want to. It's another major arcana. One, two, three, four, fifth one on the table. With two aces. Oh. Why is High Priestess here? Empress reversed. <clears throat> I think you're going to end up going with your gut. I just hope you don't take and I know I've said it a thousand times. There's no such thing as a wrong path because if you take a wrong path, there's a lesson down that wrong path that you're supposed to learn. I hope you don't choose the, the expl explanation. See these cups? Mm. There's some not so good things in some of those cups. I hope you don't choose an incorrect cup. But if you do, there's a lesson to be learned from that cup. Hmm. Why is four cups here? Double reverse. Yes. Okay. I can see it happening, Taurus. I see it. My favorite phrase, what's in the cup? However it shakes out in the end, I believe you will end up disconnecting from some toxic crap. Set that aside for now. Can I get a little clarity on the cards on the table for Taurus, please? May 2021.
Hanged Man reversed. Hmm. Someone or something still has you hung up in the gallows. Or someone is still hung up in the hangman's gallows about you. Unable to accept the fate of a situation. They possibly see you're doing well. I feel this sense of foreboding. Someone might be coming in to... Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Seven of Cups came out again. And it came out sideways. So... Reverse. Someone may be trying to steer you off the path you're trying to go down. You're doing well. And sometimes that ticks people off when they see you're doing well. If you're doing well, if that's your story. Coming in to cause confusion. You could go down a road you probably shouldn't go down. But, again, there's no wrong paths in life. Because if you go down a road you probably shouldn't have gone down, there's a reason you went down it. Why is justice here? Nine of Pentacles. She is all that and a bag of chips. She has nine pentacles of her own. She doesn't need anybody else's. Insert whatever pronoun you want. Justice worked in your favor. You're doing well. Ten of Cups. You're happy. Even better. Why is the Ace of Swords here? <clears throat> kind of came out this way. Empress reversed. Oh. Because someone or something came in with a little tidbit of information that someone or something wasn't all that it was cracked up to be. Leveling off a playing field. Probably the playing field this player's trying to drag you back down. Why is the lovers here? King of Cups. Oh, goodness. That giant cup of overflowing emotion. That's deep feels. That's deep feels. Oh, 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 gosh. Eight of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles. They see all the work you've been doing. And they've been very patiently waiting. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Ten of Pentacles. Somebody wants to make your nine into a ten. Or at least that's what they're telling you. It said, I feel something very shady coming off of this. I'm not going to tell you that it's not genuine. They may have genuine feelings for you.
But that moon card. I would be reluctant to walk back into the fun house. I'm just saying. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Page of Cups. The little girl with her little fish. Insert whatever noun you need to. It's messages. Can I get one more on that, please? Knight of Wands reversed. <clears throat> He's a stud. I mean, he is. He is. Mm. He's a prince, if you will. He's he's the king that hasn't aged up yet. But he's fire energy, so he's passion. Take that however you want. He rides in as fast as you rides on rides out again. Oftentimes, he's in the reverse. This indicates return. Why is the hermit reversed here? Full reversed. You're contemplating not jumping. Something holding you back. You haven't healed yet. You're not over it yet. <clears throat> this is somebody that wrote out of your life. Who may have very conveniently rode in, rode back in at just the wrong time. Because you're doing well. You might be seeing someone else. The, the lover's card is there. You might be seeing someone who has a coin for you. Who, want, who legitimately wants to add one more to your nine to make ten. There's someone still up in the gallows who might try to drag you up into the gallows with them. Do whatever you want. It's your journey. Can I get one more in this fool, please? One more in the full reverse, please. Oh no. Knight of Cups reversed. I shouldn't say oh no, but. You're not jumping. I don't see you taking the cup. At least in this moment, no. Let's move into your future. Why is the High Priestess here? Why is the High Priestess here? The Hermit reversed. Using your intuition. Acknowledging, yes, you're probably soulmates. There's a lesson here. You have not healed from this yet. Just because the playing field's leveled off and balance restored to your life and you were able to move forward and move on from it to something bigger and better and you're doing well does not mean you're over it. Why is the Empress reversed here? The sun. 
and the Ace of Wands reversed. I think you're going to decide that you're happy and content where you're at. And you're not going to move forward. And With thunder here. And you're not going to take his cup. And you're not going to jump. Because you haven't healed. From something that wasn't meant to go anywhere anyway. The sun's shining in your life. You're doing well. You're not going to get dragged down. The smoke and mirrors moonlit path. You're not going to get drugged into the fun house again. You're not going to let this cause you confusion or hang you up in the gallows. Why is the four of cups here? Three of wands reversed. I think you're walking away. You're walking away. There's no reason for you to stand at that dock. That ship has done sailed. They might hang out at the dock for a minute, but you're walking away. <laughs> Why is the devil reversed here? Why Nine of Swords? Page of Swords reversed. I don't think that, that's not your Nine of Swords. Nope, but that is your page. I see you cutting communication off. I see you not taking the cup. I see them having some sleepless nights, but it's, you're done. You're done. I mean, take the path if you want to. It's up to you. But if you're doing if you're doing well, why? Why? Why let him drag you into the funhouse kicking and screaming? The funhouse isn't always so fun. Let's get your advice. Seven of Wands reversed and the Prince of Swords reversed. Don't, don't let this get out of control. You need to maintain control of your existence. And I, I... Block communication if you have to. I would not engage with this person at all. Because it's only going to lead to an internal struggle. And who needs that? Seriously, who needs that? the Coast Guard's flying over. If you guys can hear the helicopter, they do that a lot here. I live by a pretty large body of water. The Wheel of the Year and the High Priestess. Okay. Okay. Acknowledge the connection for what it is and allow the cycle to close out because old cycles have to end before new cycles can begin. But use your intuition. Go with your gut. If something seems shady, it probably is. You're smart, Taurus. You know what's up. You know what's up. All right. Let me know what happens. Okay? Thank you for your time. Be blessed. Have a wonderful rest of your May. I love you to bits. Take care. Thanks for coming by.